Hey everyone, it's Gigi and today I'm going to be filming a French twist and ballet bun tutorial. So what I've done is pull my hair up into a ponytail right at the crown of my head. A good rule of thumb to tell if it's in the right place is look at the line from your cheekbone. If you suck in your cheeks, like you can see your cheekbone, and it goes diagonally up to kind of your head, then it's in the right spot. You don't want it to be too high, too low, etc. What I've also done is taken a spray bottle and just sprayed a little bit of water all over my hair and brush that through. The water just helps give your hair a sleek look, but you don't actually have to use as much like gel and hairspray. Uh, it's really important to brush through like everything you put in your hair before you would do the actual ponytail because then it like distributes all the product and just gives a nicer look because you don't want it. So now I'm going to add a tiny bit of gel and then brush that through with a smoothing brush. I've secured my ponytail with a hair tie and added a little bit of hairspray. Now it's time to do the bun. For the bun, I take two strands, splitting my hair in half, and wrap each around separately. But for this part, you kind of have to figure out whatever works for your hair, depending on like the thickness and length. This also helps me because I have very long hair. But overall, you just want the bun to be flat. So my technique is to just twist the hair, bring it around the hair tie, and press down. Grab a bobby pin or a hairpin, whatever kind you use, and just start securing one by one. If you do one strand, same thing. Twist, press, and pin. So now you should have the perfect belly bun. So for the twist, I like to start by gathering my hair at the nape of my neck. Then start twisting your hair, pulling it upwards at the same time. This should give you a nice twist. Then to get rid of the excess hair, Keep twisting, twist it around in the same way you were going, and then flip, hold that hair there, and tuck the rest. So once you've tucked that hair under, you're going to start pinning. For a twist, I like to use hair pins. They're a little bit wider than bobby pins, and they just gather more hair. But you can use whatever works for you. So as you can see, I finished pinning it in place, just to where it feels secure. I sprayed a little bit of water and used a comb to smooth away any wispies. And now I'm going to add a tiny bit of hairspray. Thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial. Stay safe and healthy.